tutorial. This tutorial is going to be about how to raise your FPS in any FPS shooter, uh, racing, games, any games that involve FPS at all, like Day Defeat, Half-Life, Deathmatch, Zombie Panic, any of these games that you can basically get from Steam or whatever. You know what I mean? Uh, one of them is you got to close all your programs before you play it, especially uTorrent. They'll raise it up, up, up a lot. And another thing you can do that works for everything is that you go to the game. This will work for any game. You just, okay, what you got to do, you go into the game that you, you, go, that you play. And then when, once you're in your game, what you do is you click the little squiggly button above the tab above the tab key on your keyboard and that should activate your uh, developer console and if it doesn't here's what you do you go to options keyboard advanced and click enable de developer console and then the little squiggly line and then apply and okay and then and then click the squiggly line and that should come up this thing like this and what you want to type is FPS underscore max space nine 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 it's just some really big number that has nines I guess and what you want to do is how that helps it helps by uh, increasing your FPS uh, like the the default value is FPS max 71 and what that does is it sets your FPS to the most FPS you can get is 71 in the game and with this it'll go as high as your computer will let you so you get more FPS hopefully and the reason why I say hopefully is because some computers can only go 71 FPS and but if it goes more that's great uh, I hope this helped if uh, you want more videos and more tutorials please subscribe and if you have any issues or problems please message me and I'll try to help or make a video on it or do whatever I can thank you